shot. Hey, you. Who's talking? Up here, silly. What? Who are you? I'm the narrator, but that's not important. Narrator? Are you feeling left out of your social circle? Uh, yeah, I guess. Do you have bad grades and no clear direction in your life? Oh, jeez, yeah, I do. I mean, I was gonna go the community college route, but then I feel- Do you have excessive antisocial behavior and a neglectful home life that leads you wanting to repeatedly carve into your friends or strangers and do unspeakable things with the bodies? What? Right? <laughs> what? Who are you talking to? Them, right? Right there. You see them, right? So first things first, head into the kitchen and find yourself a weapon. But I can't. Johnny's mom's in there. That might be a problem, but worry not. What happened to her? Where did she go? Oh, she's just in the void now. No need to panic. What? So first thing about being a serial killer is you need a weapon. Whether it's a chainsaw or a knife or someone else's nightmares, a weapon is the most important thing about murder. This is just like what happened with Robbie and the strawberry. Where do I start? Anywhere. We're in a kitchen, so it's not like our options are limited. No. No. Here, how about we just go for the classic slasher kitchen knife? What am I doing in the shower? You must watch your victim 24 hours a day to learn their habits and when they're most vulnerable. <laughs> Oh. Dude, are you in my shower? Uh, no. Okay. Oh my gosh. Life. I love it. <laughs> I had no idea being a serial killer would be this much fun. I mean, I'm spending so much more time with my time friends- Time to kill him. What? All of your training has been for this one chance. Okay. <laughs> what? Oh, I just stabbed you. Yeah, uh, you did actually. Uh, why'd you do that? They told me to. Ooh, oh, it's like what happened with Robbie when he got choked out by the strawberry? Yeah. Man, I don't want to kill you. I know. Fine, then I'll just kill both of you. <laughs> <laughs>